Noon, a deadly dog attack. The victim, a 14-year-old boy. Neighbors say that they knew there were dogs on the property, but they're shocked by this. Thanks for joining us. I'm Chris McKinnon. I'm Brianna Pitts, in for Kate Merrill. Investigators worked into the night at the home as they started to try to figure out what happened. WBZ's Michelle Fisher has the story from Dighton. This afternoon, what we know is that a 14-year-old boy from Rehoboth was killed, apparently mauled by a dog or dogs during an attack here at a home on Maple Swamp Road. And since that attack, several dogs have been removed from the property. At least three dogs taken from this home are now in the custody of animal control. This unidentified man visibly upset by the task of loading them into the back of a van overnight, hours after police say a teen was apparently mauled to death. So with everything that's gone, it's such a tragic thing. It was just a lot to take in. Dighton police say they were called to the home just before 8 after a neighbor found the teen's body and called 911. Neighbors say they knew dogs lived on the property but have never had any trouble. You do hear dogs barking occasionally, but beyond that, everybody's kind of doing their own thing. It's very quiet here. It's unclear if the homeowner was around at the time of the incident. In a statement, the Dighton Rehoboth School Superintendent said, It is with a heavy heart that we have heard the news of the tragic death of a Rehoboth teenager. Please know that our thoughts and prayers are with his family and friends at this time. Right now, the district attorney's office is saying that foul play is not suspected, but does say the investigation is just getting started. Reporting in Dighton, I'm Michelle Fisher, WBZ News.